Hello again. Right, what we're going to do this time is I'm going to show you how to make the eye control pad show up as a mouse because the eye control pad can fake being many of the devices as a, shall we say, precaution for any attempts to stop it working with certain devices. So what we need to do is the code for making it show up in this case as a mouse <coughs> is to press the A and B buttons. I've actually got the buttons put in the wrong way on this, but let's just ignore that and that's A and B. Right. So to do this, we hold, we hold down A and B and we press the start button. Okay, now that's now <coughs> pretending to be a mouse and we can go to discovering new devices. I'm going to look for any device and click continue. And there it is showing up there. I'm going to go into pass key options and we're going to use a, a key for it. Don't let it use an empty key or generate a key. Use the key. And we've got to continue. And then the key is one, two, three, four. And now the Mac, and it would be very similar on the PC, now believes the eye control pad is a mouse. And if we use the nub, we can move it around as a mouse. And OK, so this time what we're going to do is we're going to make the eye control pad identify as a keyboard, which is pretty handy because the iPhone supports keyboard as standard. Right, so same thing again, but this time we're going to turn it on and we're going to hold down the A button as we turn it on and that activates pretend keyboard mode. So hold down the A button, press start for a couple of seconds, let go, it'll give a couple of flashes to indicate it's in keyboard mode. And then again, we're going to search for devices, any device, continue, it'll look around there. This time it thinks it's a keyboard. Um, Pass key again, use a, a pass key, continue. Now it'll detect the keyboard and continue. And we enter one, two, three, four. Now what the Mac does, I don't think the PC does this, but the Mac tries to make you type things on the keyboard to make sure it's identified. You don't need to do this. Um, just wait till this does its thing here. Um, and Yep, we can quit that and if we go into um, Notepad or whatever it's called on the Mac, we should be able to type with the uh, buttons. And of course on a iPhone app, if you put it into keyboard mode, the iPhone has no idea and you can use this with a non-jailbroken device. We're not promising that Apple will allow that to happen but we can't see how they can really avoid it unless they put in some sort of verification system that makes you type your name. But I, I just can't see them doing something like that.